Hi everyone, we back to the network routing fundamental issues or hack up. Um, that is a, uh, I consider for me is a big issue with the network a troubleshooting for a daily basis is the asymmetric route and symmetric route. The, the normal behavior they call a symmetric route, which is I try to simulation for you here through the GNSC3 here. Let me give you the idea for this issue and maybe the next tutorial we're talking about how to resolve this problem or what the tools use it to resolve this problem so i've got here uh, three router in front of you here you can see here router one and i've got router two router three so this link as you can see uh, the network is 12.11/24 another side two and this network is 23.112 and one uh, two and three respectively and this network here which is I guess this is co is for the issue here uh, the network is 13.11 and another side 13.113 so I will use a static route I just need to emulate and simulate the problem for you I need to show you the problem for asymmetric route but before that I want to show you the symmetric route which is the normal behavior so in the router one, I ask him, uh, in router three, I have a loopback. I've got loopback here. That loopback is the destination for my lab. So from router one, I say, if you need this network, 3.3.3, .3 jumping and your next hub will be router two. Perfect. You see here, router two. Router two, I've got static router as well. I see, please, if you're looking for uh, 333, your next hub will be router 3 which is this next hub perfect and router 3 here I have two uh, static route um, I will use or already configure actually the number one looking for anything you see here 4040 which is a default route IP route 4040 destination your next hub should be this way so means the reply will be goes back to the router two then from router two back to the router one this is they call symmetric route what does mean actually is the meaning or the fundamental for this issue just one minute what does mean is essentially means if your traffic goes from this way the symmetric route or the normal behavior should be back within same way so this they call a symmetric route means the traffic is goes from this way should be back from exactly the same way so what the meaning asymmetric route okay the asymmetric route mean if your traffic looking for a three goes to this way and the replies come from this way this is they call a symmetric route this is the issue here so this issue actually it is mostly problem with the firewall if you have a firewall here the firewall say yeah hey your traffic is goes from this interface and reply from this interface this is mostly potential of attack maybe this is like attack or hacking traffic so that's why immediately drop the traffic here and no traffic the question I guess here, where is the symmetric route will be appear in my network? If your network is growing year by year, uh, the routing traffic or the routing configuration is add, remove, add and remove. There is a lot of a multi-path between the source and destination with a different way. So this issue will be appear. Let me show you the normal way through the, this configuration. And after that, we will simulate the asymmetric route. Okay, I go ahead to router one here and I just show you my configure here in router one here. This is a router one here. Show IP interface brief. This is my two interface, one and three, which is goes to router three and one two go to router two. Then show run section IP route. I have a two default route here, goes to three, use the router two here and uh, four zero default route also go to uh, go to the router two. Actually, I need that one for the test purpose. I will show you that uh, later on. 
In router two, very simple configure here. You can see show IP interface brief. There's a middle router here and show run section IP route. Also, I have this is static route uh, guide router two. If you need a 333, go to the router three. So you can see here the result from show run. Show run section IP route. You can see here, this is the default route here. In router three, show IP interface brief. I have a two interface to router two, to router one, and a loop back. I have a loop back here, which is uh, the destination for router one. Show run section IP route. So we can see the configuration for router three right there. So router three, I use this as symmetric route. I show you the normal behavior first. Then after that, I delete this guy and then configure another static route or another default route to pointing to another router. Okay, you can see here, this is the configuration. Uh, say to router three, if you need or reply, anything goes to the router two. Good. I go ahead to router one and you just issue ping 333. Sorry. Here you go. Ping 333. You can see here I have a reply. Uh, you see, uh, gig 0 slash 0. If I shut down that interface, interface G0 slash 0, shut down. And I do ping again. I wait, this guy's become down. So as you can see here, is down the interface 0 slash 0. Then I say ping. You can see the ping is work. Mean this guy he not contribute to the traffic flow. All the traffic is good with the normal behavior, or they call symmetric route. I can do a quick debug here to understand the idea here. I can say debug IP packets. It's just normal, and they say ping to three three three. Repeat one time. One time is much more enough just to understand which interfaces deal with this ping or with the ICMP traffic. You can see all my configure here. I can see 0 slash 1, 0 slash 1, 0 slash 1. There is nothing about 0 slash 0. Cool. So I go to the interface or uh, router 3 and I try to do the asymmetric route. So in router 3 here, I will go to the router 3. Then I will say config t, no, this comments, I don't need that. I don't need to point everything to the router 2. Now I put it that comment, which is point everything to router 1 again, router 1. Okay, I use that link. So I will say here, uh, please do the same comment, but rather to put it 2, 3, just put it to 1, 3, dot 1, 1, 1. Okay, so I just say enter here. Okay, back to the router one and try to do the ping. But before that, remember, I turn off this guy just now, 0 slash 0. So I just say interface G0 slash 0, no shutdown. Because right now we need it. Why we need it? Because router 3 now pointing all the traffic goes to the router 1, should be based to the number 2 asymmetric route, which is they cause the issue, which is they call asymmetric route. So after uh, this interface up ping to the 333 perfect is work now let me test this uh, result for this one debug ip packets again you remember the previously debug ip packets we don't have anything related to g0/0 all uh, router one deal with the 0/1 now debug ip packets then i do ping ping to 333 three, three. repeat one time is much more enough then we can see here now come up in the picture interface g0 slash 0 and another interface which is g0 slash 1 mean the traffic is go goes to this interface first 0 slash 1 and back to the interface 0 slash 0 this is means I have a symmetric route, which is mean the traffic is goes using one way and the reply is coming to another way. 
So let me check more here. I can do config t interface g0 slash 0 shutdown. If I shut down this guy, should be my request time it out is appear here because my ping doesn't work right now. Because you can see here repeat one time or two time. You see now I have dot which is mean my request is doesn't work or my ping is doesn't work. You all let me turn off the debug ping to 333. You can see I don't have any reply. Why? Because the reply is coming from here from G0 slash 0 and G0 slash 0 is already tearing off. So it means the idea right now they call asymmetric route. The traffic is go from here and reach to the router 3 and the reply coming from here. If you have a firewall here, will be drop the traffic. Um, last point I need to show you as well, uh, how to identify this issue uh, rather than debug. So it's a very important uh, way for check if you have an asymmetric route. Go to the router one here and issue the command config t. I will turn it on the interface again, zero slash zero, no shutdown. Then I make sure is work. Pink dot three is work perfect. I will say trace route to three 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 here. You can see I have two hop count right. But when I go to the three three three, the destination here, this guy. When I say pink to one two dot one one one, because the traffic is come from this guy. Okay, so I just say enter here. Make sure is accessible. Yep will be accessible here. I just say also trace route 12.111 and enter. I can see one hop count. And in another side here in router one, I see two hop count. This is mean asymmetric route. There is a uh, there is two hop count from the source to destination, but from destination to source, they have a one hop account. This is they call asymmetric route. For the normal behavior will be two by two in our design here because if the reply is come to the same way should be two hop account same the router one also should be have two uh, hop count um, i hope this information is help you to identify the problem for isometric route and probably the next tutorial will be talking about some type of solution for isometric route thank you for watching and see you with the new tutorials